Hi everybody and welcome to a how-to tutorial from the Maiden group. Today we're going to discuss the live chat function. So enabling the live chat function on your microsite is a great way to engage potential customers and visitors to your site. Uh, this recent feature from the Maiden group allows visitors to chat with you through your microsite. These messages will then appear in your microsite dashboard when you log in or you can chat with professionals live whilst you are logged in. So to do that, first of all, we need to enable our live chat feature. So what you would do is log in to my account, um, entering your credentials in here. If you would like to reset your password, you can head to the um, Made in the Midlands or Made in Yorkshire website and head to the Knowledge Hub under Who Are We? here and you can find out how you can reset your microsite password. However, as long as you know uh, what your credentials are, you can log in, click in my account here. So mine looks a little bit different um, to how yours will appear. So I have a separate tab up here to show you how it will look. So this is the back end of your microsite, which hopefully uh, many of you already know what it looks like. So on the left hand side of your screen, what you will need to do uh, to enable your live chat editor uh, is to head to the microsite editor. Once we've clicked here, we want to scroll all the way down and you will see edit live chat function. Once you've done that, you want to ensure that the live chat function is ticked green here. So as you can see, it was already ticked for us. So um, I'll just click it again and you'll see the green tick will appear. So to ensure that any messages on your Microsoft aren't missed, you can also enter in email addresses here um, so that these conversations will be um, sent to these people if nobody responds. So remember when you're doing this to divide the email addresses by using a comma as we've done here. The last step you want to do now is press save live chat just there, which is a really important step to ensure that your live chat is enabled. So now you are all ready to go. So you can view your live chat conversations on the left hand side here. So you just want to head to live chat uh, on your dashboard. And as you can see, we've had quite a few people chatting with us already. So all of your conversations for anybody who um, heads over to your microsite, you will be able to view the conversations here and shrink the list if you wish. So it's kind of like, uh, you know, other messaging services like from Facebook or, uh, or Twitter or other social channels like that. So, you can check if any visitors are online by viewing the profile of the person. So on this um, conversation here, which is just a test, uh, in order to see if this person is online, I would click their profile in the top right hand corner there. So as you can see, the red dot means that this person is offline. Uh, but if this dot appears green, let's see if anybody on here is live now, it will appear green on here. So we'll just X that off. And then all, in order to save your conversations, all you do need to do is click this icon here and archive your chat. So that is how you use your live chat function if you would like to enable it on your microsite. To view and ensure that your live chat is functioning correctly and appearing on your microsite, all you need to do is head to your microsite. So if I type in made, made in group here, and visit microsite. You can see that the live chat function is just here. So people can message you or us through here. Thank you very much.